Alright, let's try that again, except this time not completely slaughter an entire group of people. Because of their social status. Oh, you're awake this time, I'm sorry. Oh, you're shooting the rats. Bro, I was about to kill you. Oh my god. Dude, your police system is insane. Uh, this is like the chef in here, yeah. Or bartender, of course. This is the Trudy. I don't know you. Alex Hawthorne, captain of the unreliable. I'm Chester. The unreliable, you say? Never heard of any company supply ship with that particular name. It's I don't a know private what you're ship. About, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal what a name. company folk here. What an enticing name. Oh, let's get my charm going. And what a fine establishment it is. You really think so? Yeah, I do. That's kind of you. What's this about deserters? Traitors. The lot of them. Bunch of folks decided they were tired of working and went out into the wilds to fend for their own selves. Town's already struggling. Ah, you mean the marauders. Even without that band of slackwits abandoning their posts. Bunch of lazy, shiftless rung leeches. Anyway, <laughs> rung leeches. Enough about I'll have a drink. Coming right up. Do what you got for me. <laughs> and I'm gonna sell you everything I have. I don't need 50 freaking pistols, so... This woman's wondering why she now owns a bunch of pistols. <laughs> As a simple bartender. Baristas. Hell yeah, dude. I love just stealing everything. <laughs> Alright, this is where I'm supposed to be. There's marauders in here or something, right? And I have to take them out? Or maybe I, I attack these guys. Yeah, I was just going around killing everybody. Why are you killing the Sparats? Guys, stop. Sparats are dope AF. I believe I killed them because they saw me robbing or something. I gotta stop killing people. Alright, let's go get my first follower. You gotta have that. Weird ass elevator music. How you guys doing? Seems we've got a guest. How you doing, Reed? Really now, Pavati, I do wish you'd spoken up. I do apologize. I was given no forewarning of your arrival, or I might have welcomed you at the gates myself. Uh, no, I will not wait until you're finished. Uh, I'm that self-righteous. You must be the town boss. I'm Reed Thompson, outpost administrator. I cannot help but notice you are not in uniform. Should I be in uniform? I don't work for Spacious Choice, sir. My ship needs repairs. I'm looking for a power regulator. Only regulator we got is hooked up to the town transformer. Mr. Tobson ain't liable to be keen on dismantling it. I beg your pardon. I am most emphatically not keen on any such thing. I can't let you have our power regulator. But I happen to know of another one. And I happen to know exactly how you may retrieve it without frying yourself in the process. Let's hear it. Frying myself. Sir, I am not an egg. That, that's not in the dumb. It should be. Oh, yes. Speak to their leader, Adelaide. Tell her the power's about to go. And that it's time her band of deserters came back to town. I can't make any promises, but I will take that okay, power I supply. I don't need Parvati's help. Are you sure? I imagine Miss Holcomb will make a reliable companion. She knows her way around the Vale. Alright, fine, bitch. Come on if you're coming. Great! I got my wrenches and diagnosticators and hairpins and engine tape, so... I'm all set! Come on, ma'am. Try not to die. <sighs> we better clear out of Mr. Thompson's office before we talk. Alright, she wanted to get the hell out of there. Hey, mister, can we talk? Sorry. What? what? Sorry. I... You just want to get out of here. And you likely don't want to tag along like me. It's just... Mr. Thompson has his own view on matters. On account of it's his job and, and what all, but... 
that's not the only side of the tale. If I wanted to deal with nuance, I wouldn't be this heavily armed. Barely armed. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Alright, from this point on, I have not progressed the game. We did one session back in 2021. And it all got corrupt. Alright, let's go. We actually gotta go the other way around. That volcano doesn't look like it's going well. Did the volcano just erupt? And watch your step, goddamn. All right, prove yourself. God damn it. I gotta walk all the way back here. Why are marauders everywhere, dude? Damn it, they're already here. We barely even moved. Your guards need to get to work if there's marauders right outside of your community. Jesus. Oh shit, good luck. Why did I die so damn fast? What do I have to do? I need to buy some armor. Alright, send her ass in. I don't think she can die. If she can, Godspeed. No, she's dead. How you doing, Grace? Along, stranger. We don't want any trouble. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. Alright, fine. Fuck. What's your problem? Armed strangers wandering into my camp for one. I disarmed. Some of my camp wandering out for another. You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. Yeah, dude. Uh, what's your uh, fucking... Uh... Like... Pisces or whatever it's fucking called. What's yours? That's how I'm gonna judge you. Reed sent me to make peace with you. That's his name, Reed. Reed Thompson? You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Yeah. Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace, then? I'm gonna take all your fucking power and you're gonna have no choice but to go back to the capitalist society. Something about coming back to town or losing power. I wasn't really listening. I can't say I blame you. You're doing this for Reed. Why? Because I need that power. I'm doing it for myself. My reasons are my own. Seem like the right thing to do. <laughs> Reed's taking you for a sap. You're an outsider. And he's trying to use you for his own end. No, I'm using him for my own ends. Let's say I help you. What happens to Edgewater? Life in Edgewater grinds to a halt. The cannery shuts down. Workers desert in droves. And our own little camp grows and thrives. You think Reed's just trying to spite you? I, I, I keep clicking the wrong button. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Very in-depth. Now, what's my companion going to think of what I end up doing? That's going to be the fun part. Is she going to be pissed? Is she going to be happy? Is she going to cry like a little bitch? Here we are, the power plant. Oh, God, it's been taken over. So these are just the marauders. What the is this? Oh, never mind. That thing sucks. Bro! Why is this same? <laughs> Why is this game so damn hard? Thanks. Nice diversion. <laughs>
It was useful to be around after all. Dude, we got a vending machine, but that's not what we're supposed to do. Uh, get button. Oh, no, you can just walk right through that. No way, Phantom! What? Who just said that? Not real. You're not real. Higgins? Who the hell is Higgins? Bro, they are O fucking P! This is what I get for cheesing Fallout so hard. Fuck Edgewater, dude. Let's go against the capitalist system. Well, what are your thoughts? I can't stop thinking on Edgewater, Captain. I'm glad the deserters are gonna be alright now they got power, but... What about the town? All those people? We don't care about people, we care about ourselves. I'm going back to Edgewater? Why would I fucking do that? Okay, I'm just gonna take their power regulator. You know, you know it's fine, because it'll be really fucking funny. <laughs> Unless I have to fight my way out, which will not be as funny. Incoming. Oh shit, it's that monkey thing! No wonder they killed it! Bring it back to town! Oh god, I see like no lights in town. I mean, obviously we did cut off their power, but... <laughs> oh, this ain't gonna be good. I'm gonna go to the front of the town, see everything. Here on display. Oh, Silas, how you doing? Oh. Look out. Wait, you're not fucking Silas? Oh, there's numerous of them. Just run, just run. Ow, dude, I got hit by a monkey. Alright, I'm bringing numerous monkeys to Silas. Knows how long. Looking to get drunk? Yep. Power's gone. Everyone's gonna react differently. How's the barber doing? That posh little bitch. Oh, I can cut my own hair. I can't possibly cut anyone's hair in the dark. I screwed over the entire town. This is my first punishment. Let's go see what Reed has to say. Edgewater has suffered a cavalcade of disasters, plague, marauders, desertion. Then you wandered in town. <laughs> and I was so damn sure our luck was starting to turn. I never knew how right I was. Just answer one question for me. Why'd you do it? Don't know. I like pressing buttons, I guess. That, that's like 100% true, though. <laughs> that's basically all I did. I made my choice by pressing a button. Wonderful. Law have mercy. Well done, Reed. You went and delivered the fate of Edgewater into the hands of a certified imbecile. How the f how fucking dare you? We're hoping to find down here. I advise you to turn around and leave. I have got guards posted with orders to fire on you. All off your guards. I don't want them to bleed all over my power regulator. I, I can't do shit. I've, I haven't killed a single thing in this game. They kill me in like a seconds. All right, easy now. Let's not do anything we'll regret. We're for the power regulator. Y'all don't want a shovel stuck up your ass. Looks like a wooden shovel. You'd get tons of splinters. I'd suggest staying out of my way. All right, let's get back to the ship. All right, where do you want me to put this power regulator, Ada? Uh, what can I do for you, Captain? I have a power regulator. Do you know how to install a power regulator? Yeah, I know what I'm doing. Outstanding, Captain. Your aptitude for engineering will prove invaluable in the event of another catastrophic engine failure. I don't know how I'm the biggest idiot in the universe, but I, I can. The cargo bay, up the ladders. Wow, 
What can I do for you, Captain? I've installed it. All systems are operating within acceptable parameters. I am prepared to bring the unreliable into low altitude orbit. This should prove an adequate test of our flight capabilities. All right, ship's done. Next time, we're going to take it into the air, see where we go. Till next time, I'm going to bed. Good night. Ooh.